Hello, good evening, good morning, good afternoon, wherever you are listening from. Welcome to Life Up, another great opportunity to share great information with you. So this is Life Up. We are here to assist you in your journey abroad. If you want to study abroad, if you want to work abroad, um, we have most of the information here for you. We give you all the necessary guidelines that you need, specifically those who want to teach in the United States, those who want to school in Canada, United States, and any other job that you are interested in. Today, I'm bringing you um, a very short information on the US DV visa, diversity it's uh, popularly known as the Amer American Lottery. American Lottery. So I'm just coming to give you a very brief information on it. But before we move on, I will encourage you to subscribe. If you have not subscribed to this family yet, please do well to subscribe and hit the notification button so that you don't miss any video, so that you don't miss any video that we put update. Um, there are so many videos here that will help you do well to go through. If you have any question, do not hesitate to write up to lifeapp201 at gmail.com. We will respond to you as soon as possible. Yeah, I plan on um, having live videos, so that is something that you may want to check. You know, if you go to, if you just open the live app, the home page comes first. So you see a home page that will come. You wouldn't see the live video here. Like you can go here to see all the videos. Um, I don't do much shots, but over here is where the shots are. I don't do much shots. Um, maybe I have to get some time and then do it. But if you come to live, that is where all the live videos goes. That's what all the live videos were. So this particular live video is something that you may want to check. Um, those who want to study in Canada, there are some programs that you need not to um, apply to those programs because they will not give you the necessary document to settle in Canada after your school. So check this video and see that. And then there are some other live videos that you would see because um, if you go to the um, page, you wouldn't see the live video unless you click on live. So I'll be doing live from time to time. So do well to check the live video. So thank you for being with us always. I appreciate your support and everything that you are doing. Please keep sharing for others to get all the necessary information that is needed. Okay, so now let's go to the main purpose for today, the diversity visa, the diversity visa. So, you know, as you all know, this is a program that the United States of Department give opportunity for other nationals to apply for green card in the United States. And then it is a yearly drawn program that they do. So this year, it was open on October 4th. Today is October 8th. So October 4th, that was last Wednesday. That was when it was open. And then it will end on November 7th. So from now, the um, portal is open to put in your application. But there are some few things that you need to do. If you are doing your application yourself, make sure that you are at this website. If you're doing it yourself, make sure that you're at this website. Um, dvprogram.state.gov. And then you, could, you should be able to see this. You see the instruction is here. Photo example is here. And then begin entry. So here is where you are going to start your begin entry. And it's the same um, website that you use to check your status if you did but um let's see some few things that you need to do so here is what it says that it has been open already four days ago and then it is completing or they will close 
um, the application portal on November 7th, 2023. The entry form will only be available for submission during this period and this period only. So when November 7th, I think 12 p.m. EST, 12 p.m. EST, take note of the time EST, which is minus 5 GMT. So you should know that um, the GMT Ghana time is leading the EST by five hours. By then, it will be leading it by five hours. But the time, yeah, I think the time change on exactly November 7th. Yeah, the time will change on November. So you should know that the 12 p.m. EST doesn't mean 12 p.m. Um, Ghana uh, time. The GMT is not doesn't mean Ghana man time anymore. But I'm just saying Ghana time for you to know that that's not the meaning of GMT. Yeah, this is just by the way. So make sure you are putting in your application within this time. This time. So we'll look at some of the instructions here. So yeah. Or if you go to this website, this is the State Department website. One thing you could check it's always make sure that the website ends with go. But make sure you are at the right website if you are doing it yourself. If you are doing it yourself. So some important information that you need to know. So yeah, so this is for those who have applied already. Warning for fraud and scam. You know, some website and emails attempt to mislead customers who seen as providers of official U.S. government information. So that is what you need to do. Complete your own application. The online and entry application is easy and free. So there is no money in this. Complete your own application. So that's what I mean. make sure you have this website. The misleading website will not help you. So the online registration for 2025, like I've talked of the dates already. One thing you need to note here, it says that submission of more than one entry for a person during the registration period will be, will disqualify all entries for that person. So you need to submit only one entry. So here is where you need to take note. I know some people do the entries for people. They take their um, data, they have their pictures. And then if they, they did it last year for you and you did not win, and this year too, they will do it without even contacting you or consulting you. So if you have somebody like that, please make sure that the person is not doing it without your notice so that you wouldn't have multiple entry. You don't have to have just one entry because if you have multiple entry, it will disqualify you. And then your forms will not be even picked to process, uh, to be put even in the draw. So that is very, very important. I'll put these links um, in the description of this video so that you can check and check because and then this is very important, the instructions. This is the in instructions. And then it said, apart from what is at this website, there is no other instruction. And that, that is what I've opened here, this PDF. So this is the instruction on everything that you need to do. They give you all the instruction on how to do it, how to do it. So this is very important. One advice i'll give you is i know some of you will want people to do for them and charge them that is fine that is your own decision but um what i would advise you is if somebody is doing it for you make sure or let a person it will be even advisable you are there whilst the person is doing it for you let a person use your email address let a person use your email address and then get the confirmation letter or like the confirmation page after the application is submitted they give you a confirmation page with um confirmation codes that you use to check when 
um, it's time for you to check the status, whether you were picked or not. Don't let a person use their email address and then keep the confirmation. Get Use your own email address for the application and then get the confirmation so that you can check it yourself. I know some of the agents may not want to give you that because when you win, that is where they are going to tell you, give us this money and then we give you your confirmation and then we process it for you. So they know if you take it and then you win, you may not come back. To be fair with you, they are doing the work for you. They are applying for you. If you can, if you pay them, talk with them, let them use your email, get a confirmation and pay them for the work that they did and pay them for the work that they did. In that case, you wouldn't be in that dilemma where you have to pay those ridiculous amount or they have to like a whole lot of things. So that's just an advice that I'm giving you. So thank you, the DV Lottery um, Diversity Visa is open and it will, it will close on November 7th, 12 p.m., 12 noon EST, 12 noon EST. So make sure you want to do it. If you need assistance on this, please do well to contact Life app. If you have time, we will help you. We'll guide you with what you need to do. Um, if you have not subscribed to Life app, please do well to subscribe to Life app. There are so many information here that will be very helpful to you. Yeah. Thank you very much. See you next time. Please subscribe and share, like the video. Thank you, bye.